Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C square. In this example we need to find RT. RT is a segment that is tangent to the circle O. That is very important. And what else we know? We know at OR it's 6 and AT is 4. So first of all let's take a look to this property. If a line or a segment in our case is tangent to a circle, the line is perpendicular to the radius. So if we look in here, this is tangent to the circle, that's what it says in the problem, therefore is perpendicular on the radius. So we have a right triangle there, that's the most important thing so far. Right triangle, this is O R T. Okay, so we notice here, hmm. We have a right triangle, we know this is 6. If we can't find how much this OT is, then we can use Pythagorean theorem, theorem and find what they're asking for, which is RT. But how do I find OT? I need you to take a look back in this picture. If you notice, OT is nothing else than the sum of OA and AT is the segment addition postulate. And if we take a look, always is nothing else than the radius. So it's 6. AT is given to us is 4, so OT will be 10. So now we can go back in this triangle and we can use a famous theorem, Pythagorean theorem, to find the missing leg. A squared plus B squared equals c squared. Now be careful, a can be 6 or x, it doesn't matter, let's say it's 6, 6 squared, b is added, the other legs, x, x squared, and c is the longest side in the triangle, the hypotenuse, which is 10, and we're going to have 10 squared. So then we have 36 plus x squared equals 100, subtract 36, and we get 64, and if you want to find x, just take square root. And since this is geometry, we're going to keep only the positive one. And we end up with x equals square root of 64, which is 8. RT is 8. And that's it. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C squared for more help. Thank you.